What's going on, everybody? Dogman Dan here. I apologize if this uh, video is going to seem rushed or anything like that. Uh, it's just really, really tired. But I want to get these two setups out to you on the Machete Wraith and the Prova Vandal. They're pretty lighthearted setups. Let me just show you what we did here. Uh, they're very similar, okay, in how I did it. I used Corrosive on both of those. But uh, quickly, it's the Sundering Weave stance, which is all right stance. Nothing wrong with it at, at, at all. Um, in this case, we're using the Fever Strike and the Shocking Touch. Okay, getting the 90% on there. Uh, I actually used Prime Reach. This is where I've got it. I got 105% range, which does make a big difference over the regular Reach is 60%. Uh, but I liked this on both of these weapons. Uh, it just seemed to have... This utility seemed to have played a big role in how effective those two weapons are. Of course, I'm using my life strike as always. This is this is my personal uh, choice to always use a maximum one. Now on the machete, of course, because we actually have uh, regular damage types on here, in particular the slash, I am using the buzz kill. I am using jagged edge. And of course, I am using pressure point. And I got fever or fever fury in here for extra attack speed. So we've got a nice attack speed that's coming out of it. Uh, channel cost I'm not too worried about. None of that stuff really bothers me. But we're getting some nice spin attacks, and you can do some pretty good spins with the Sundering Weave stance. And again, we're getting a decent slash and a really decent uh, corrosive in here as well. So I kept it real simple. Uh, after setting it all up, I kind of took it back down to a kind of a basic. And like I said, the Prime Reach actually works really, really well on here. And in, as you can see, it's only uh, about halfway ranked, so we're not even at the max rank there at this point. But th this was just the way that uh, I enjoyed it. There's a couple different things you could do, obviously, changing around, you know, your element to whatever you like and such. You don't, if you don't have Jagged Edge Buzz Kill, you can put maybe even a second uh, element set in there if you'd like, that type of thing. Uh, but I kept it really simple, and it plays really well just just like that. Sometimes overthinking it uh, is actually a bad thing, uh, in my opinion. And then on the Pro of Vandal, now the Pro of Vandal being a straight-up element-only weapon, we're going to change things around here just a tiny bit. So we've got Pressure Point, uh, because that's our only melee damage one that I really want to use on here. I'm not going to use Spell Strike. I don't want to... Uh, remove attack speed here um, too much and as you can see I've only got a 8 on the attack speed out of 9 I, 25% out of 30% and that's just because uh, I don't have the extra capacity without putting Forma into it but again the Sundering Weave uh, we're going to use a little bit of everything here so some Fever Strike, Burlant Scourge, Voltiac Strike and Shocking Touch uh, and that's going to all combine in to get the 420 corrosive, giving me almost uh, the same amount here in terms of wall attack. A little bit lower on the spin attack uh, than than the actual machete, but what we're getting here is we're getting this beautiful 44% status chance. So we're going to proc corrosive a lot, making this weapon feel like it's a little more powerful than the numbers would actually suggest. But again, we're going to utilize Prime Reached. Uh, reach, if I could speak. Wow, I'm just, I'm really, I don't know what, long day at work. Um, so we're going to utilize the Prime Reach because it just works well with these two weapons. And again, the Life Strike, when you need it. It's not often that you need it, uh, but when you need it, it's always good to have that as a utility. And of course, you know, personal preference on how high you want to use life strike basic life strike all the way up until the max life strike i prefer max life strike when i want to get my life uh back i want it all back at one time boom i'm done so i don't have to channel too too much again what makes this one stand out is going to be that 44 percent status chance uh the proc the corrosive and of course the provo vandal having the innate electricity uh when you do the slam attacks and such is automatically it's kind of like an extra on top of whatever you do with the elements here um, and, and it just works it just works so comments questions on either of those otherwise I'll catch you guys uh, in the next episodes thanks again as always and we'll see you soon